631 right now the country is watching Nevada. We are one of five states that are still too close to call this morning. Thanks for being with us, everyone. I'm Alex Backus. I'm John Langler. Of course, we're talking about the race for the White House. Let's look at the numbers as we stand here. Joe Biden here in Nevada leads President Trump by about 7,600 votes. Nevada, though, is going to release new vote totals later this morning at about 9. Now, shortly before 6 this morning, the president tweeted this, quite simply, stop the count. This, as we learn, the Trump campaign is holding a press conference here in Las Vegas this morning. We understand that's happening at 8.30, just ahead of getting those updated results at 9 o'clock. They will be the first results we have gotten since yesterday morning. So mm. with more on this, let's go over to Hector Mejia. He is live with more. Good morning, Hector. Hey there, good morning, and it's definitely taken a lot longer than any one of us would like, but the county here says, one, they're still counting, and two, they want to get it right. This morning, we're finally getting new numbers for the first time in 24 hours from both the county and the state, and with the race being so close, that update will give us a better picture in the race for the White House. The state's six electoral votes could be what Joe Biden needs to uh, reach 270. Biden leads President Donald Trump here in Nevada by a thin 7,600 votes. The Secretary of State for Elections says there are ballots in the mail stream that are still working their way through into the building right behind us where we're at live this morning. Mail ballots can be counted up to a week after the election as long as they were postmarked by Election Day. Registrar of Voters Joe Gloria told us all early and all Election Day votes have already been counted. And this morning, there's more than just mail ballots left to count. Provisional ballots, electronic ballots that were sent to overseas voters, electronic ballots that were processed for disabled voters, and also some special ballots for new residents. So a lot will be happening here throughout the day at our local elections department. We have media from around the country here this morning. The county says it can count up to 70,000 ballots a day. Workers are opening mail ballots, checking signatures, scanning them. And while we're learning new numbers this morning, it could take several days for final results to be released. So again, at 8.30 this morning, the Trump campaign will be holding a press conference here. At 9 o'clock this morning, the state will provide new numbers. And then at 10 o'clock this morning, that is when we will receive an update from the county on their efforts here as they continue counting mail ballots here in the building right behind us. Reporting live from North Las Vegas, Hector Mejia, 8 News Now.